do the A's consume orms, uh, obviously like monatomic golds and stuff like that, or is it just a bit of a yeah, uh, food? How what? <laughs> Do you have lunch? I mean, obviously, you know, lunch would be about like day thirteen of of your visit if they were having a. Do they, they, what's the deal? They are fruititarians. They're fruititarians. They eat fruit, which they grow themselves on their starships, and they freeze dry it through a process, and they turn it into little tablets, and they carry those tablets with them when they leave the mothership, and they're doing science expeditions or whatever it is that they're doing. If the ships are not big enough to have orchards to grow their own fruit, food, fruit, then what they're doing is, is they have these tablets. And uh, I tried one of these tablets once, and it was a huge disaster for me. I threw up all over the craft because it had so much oxygen in it. I just, I went into a detox like that. And, uh, you know, and I insisted on trying it. I talked a lot of smack, you know, and it all came back on me. <laughs> and then it all came out of me. That is not my proudest moment. So anyway, uh, they're fruititarians. Uh, as far as the minerals and things that are in in, in, in the soil, I do not know. I, I don't have that information. Right. Well, that'd be an interesting uh, thing to find out about how to grow fruit that has oxygen richness. Do they use, um, um, this is again a full corollary to that, so if they grow fruit on board, um, can they start with a seed and then time accelerate it in a little zone in the in the ship so that it, the plant grows and matures very quickly? Um, I would assume so. I would assume they could do something like that. But I don't have any experience. I, I've not spent a lot of time or hardly any time in their orchards to actually see how fast they grow. But then again, I would have slept through most of it <laughs> anyway. <laughs> because I needed so much sleep because of the the difference in the concepts of time so but I don't I, I don't have that experience to tell you a definitive yes but I would think with the ability of their evolved technology that yes they could so again going back did you actually try any of the the non-dried fruit the the non pill form no. that was never offered to me all right no and and the tablet uh, Mornay broke it and then broke it again and then broke off a tiny little piece and and it, and it and it and you know my first impression was that it, it sort of tasted like hay mm. you know here on the planet not that I've eaten hay but I mean I've eaten grass as a kid mm. and, and and you know you, when you're around fresh cut hay you can smell it you can taste it in your mouth yeah. it, it started like that and as soon as I chewed it. I was like, oh, my God, I was in trouble, and I knew it. I, I knew it. I was in trouble. So, Did you feel better afterwards? No, I was humiliated. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> did the ship – no, so, okay, so you made a mess on the ship, right? Did the I ship – how did – who did that? Were there people with brooms and mops, or, or did the ship just go and clean it up? Oh, what, what, um, how did that happen? I can tell you that some of the looks that I saw in my periphery were like – shocked and and Mornay just took me by the shoulder and said come with me and he just moved me out of the control room which is where this whole thing happened and into a hallway I don't know what happened afterwards I just know that I wanted to go back to earth immediately and just crawl under a rock oh go to bed for a while yeah so needless to say uh, I was not offered anything after that <laughs> 